And we're back now with a Fox 5 exclusive in Upper Marlboro. Father says his son was bullied and sexually assaulted and thinks the Prince George's County School District isn't doing enough. Fox 5's Tisha Lewis is on the story tonight. She's live from Upper Marlboro with more. Tisha. Well, it's any parent's worst nightmare, and the accusations are alarming involving students here at James Madison Middle School. Meanwhile, the school is being renovated, so the students are actually being taught at Forestville High School. We spoke exclusively to the father that details exactly what happened. The family tells us their child was bullied and then sexually assaulted. The latter taking place ladder taking place about three weeks ago and the family is saying that they just have not received enough answers. The ladder reportedly involves three students who attacked the victim while he was using the bathroom. The father says his son was using the bathroom when one student kicked down the stall door, another poured water on the victim's head, and a third student reportedly recorded the incident and airdropped it to students and staff. The three students involved are reportedly facing disciplinary action, but the victim's family says that's not enough. That's when I knew what had happened was really true. And that was devastating to know that we were not able to prepare our son to go back into that environment where he was violated and where he was exploited, where he was victimized. And as parents, that is just something that you never, ever want to do to your child, especially to a child as timid and as quiet and as, you know, introverted as our son. Again, the victim is 11 years old. The incident reportedly happened three weeks ago, and the victim, we're told, remains home out of school. Prince George's County Public Schools emailed Fox 5 saying the incident was isolated and due to the privacy, no letter was sent home to the entire student body. Meanwhile, we did reach out to Prince George's County Police Department to see if this incident was criminal in nature, and we are awaiting their response.